Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's your girl Jensine, aka Jungle Naps, and today I've got something very, very special. I'm comparing two concealers. They're both pretty hot items, very favorited. One is a little bit newer than the other, and as you can tell by the title, I'll be comparing the Tarte Shape Tape to the NARS Soft Matte Complete Concealer. So before we get into all of the products and all that jazz. If you're new here, please subscribe. I try my best to upload three times a week. And if you're an oldie but a goodie subby, hey girl, it's nice to see you again. Okay, so let's get started. Here's a visual of the two products I'll be comparing. So the Tarte Shape Tape comes in a tube like this with a doe foot applicator. You do get 0.338 fluid ounces of product. And this is the NARS Complete Concealer. It's a pot concealer. It has more of a matte finish, or at least that's what they've claimed. And you do get a little bit less product. On the box, it says you get 0.21 ounces. So you do get a little bit less with this one. This one is about $30, but from what I've seen, the price on TarteCosmetics.com is $24 for this one. So you get more product um, on this one, and I will say that the shape tape is generally heavier, a more like full coverage concealer. Um, so if you're sensitive to having heavy concealer on your under eyes, maybe this might not be the one for you. So I have yet to actually try this one out. I've swatched it, but we're going to go ahead and just compare the two today. I'm going to put the Tarte Shape Tape on this side of my face and the NARS Complete Concealer on this side of my face. So I'm gonna scoot you guys a little bit closer and then we can get started with the application. Okay, so you guys are a little bit closer now. I'm gonna start off with the Tarte Shape Tape. How I like to apply this is I just like to take the doe foot applicator and then I just draw several lines and blend it out with my Beauty Blender. Okay, so after initial application, it looks really nice. It blends out so well. And I personally have to go ahead and set my concealers, otherwise they'll crease. It doesn't matter what concealer I use. <laughs> um, so I definitely advise you to do the same unless you have super dry skin and you don't have a problem with creasing under the eyes. And right here in my little cap, I've got the Derma Blend Translucent Powder. And I didn't want to use my Laura Mercier, the darker one today, because I didn't want to alter the color for you guys, so it can be as true to color as possible. It looks really nice. You can see the side that has been concealed versus the side that hasn't been concealed. And now let's move on to the NARS Soft Matte Complete Concealer. So the great thing about these pot concealers are that they match almost identically to the Creamy Radiant concealers. So if you already know your color in the Creamy Radiant ones, you can just pick up the one that you usually use in that color and it's gonna match perfectly. So I did go ahead and look at some reviews online and they definitely advise to apply this concealer with either your fingers or some sort of concealer brush. Apparently the Beauty Blender doesn't do a great job at effectively um, you know, blending it. So I've got my little concealer brush. I'm using the Kat Von D, it's her just regular concealer brush. It has a number 40 on it, so if you have this one, this is gonna be really great. And I love that it's just got like a little pointed tip so you can get at any crevices, and it is just really good for buffing out in general. So I'm dipping this into the pot, and now let's apply. Oh wow, it looks so good already. I'm actually really surprised. Okay, so here's what it looks like before I've even set it. 
Now, I'm just going to say this. It's already very, very matte. It's not at all like slightly shiny or dewy like the Tarte Shape Tape is when it first goes on. So I'm going to use extra care and use very minimal setting powder because I don't want my under eyes to look super cakey. Okay, so first off, just looking at the two, I actually really like, I mean, both of them, obviously, like, <laughs> as you guys can tell, I already love the Tarte Shape Tape. If you watch my videos, I always use this one. It's my favorite concealer. And I'm so surprised that the colors actually match. I was expecting one to be way, way, way off, but I really like that. So in the Tarte Shape Tape, this is the color Deep. And then in the NARS, this is the color Amande or Amand, however you pronounce it. And they're actually very, very similar. So if you're someone of my skin tone, it's gonna be really, really nice for you. You're gonna have those two options. So far, I'll just say um, I'm very impressed by the NARS Soft Matte. And I think right now, at this moment in time, both of them are equal for me. I don't see a particular advantage that one has over the other because they both apply very nicely. I think as long as you have the right tools, you can blend out the NARS Soft Matte. They both look nice with just a little bit of translucent setting powder, not a lot. I don't wanna just show you guys my first impression. I wanna show you guys how it looks later on. First off, I will say that the NARS Soft Matte looks really really good it looks like it's keeping up with the Tarte Shape Tape okay so I'm gonna finish up the rest of my makeup and then I'll be back to give you guys an update okay guys so this is my check-in I've had the makeup on for probably um, I'm gonna say like nine ten hours so this side had the NARS side and I'm gonna say that I like the NARS side better than the Tarte Shape Tape although I'll still use a Tarte Shape Tape. The reason why is because on the NARS side, like there is no shadow of like a dark circle, if you know what I mean. Sometimes when you've got concealer on, you can just tell, like you can see the outline of it. And the Tarte Shape Tape one, you can see that a bit more, whereas the NARS one just looks like skin. That's the only thing that I can really think of that really differentiates the two. I will say that the NARS one, I love that it looks like skin. You know, the Tarte Shape Tape looks a tiny bit more airbrushed, but you can still see the dark circles slightly, very slightly. So the difference is very, very small, I'm gonna say that. They both look beautiful. They both held up really nicely. Neither of them creased, so that's amazing. I'm gonna continue to use both of them, and I definitely think that you guys should check out the new NARS Soft Matte Concealer, because it's super, super bomb. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna get going, because I'm super, super tired. <laughs> but um, yeah, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe already, give this a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.